Welcome to another MetaTrader training video. In this tutorial, I'm going to share with you 10 things you might not know about the MetaTrader 4 trading platform. Even if there are a couple of items you don't know that are on the list, the video will be worthwhile. Okay, let's jump in and get started. One. If you have multiple charts on your trading platform, there is an auto arrange button right here. If it's not showing, just right click, go to customize. It should be in the available list here. Highlight it, click insert and click close. The button will then show. If I click the button, it will auto arrange the charts for me. Even if I delete a couple of charts, I can click the button again to auto arrange. Perhaps I even add a couple of charts I click my button, it auto arranges the charts for me, which is much quicker than trying to size these things manually. Two. If you're using multiple monitors, there are some boxes and items on the MetaTrader trading platform that can be put, placed on other monitors, such as the market watch and the terminal. If I click and drag this, I can move it to my other monitor. You can't see that, but it's on my additional monitor right now and I can bring it back in. To put it back into place, just put it to where it should be and it will click back into place. Three. It's possible to chat with other MetaTrader users. There is this chats feature at the top here. If you click on that, you have to create a free account and sign in. You can then create chat groups and message other MetaTrader users privately as well as publicly. If you have a small group of traders that you're friends with and they all use MetaTrade, it's a great feature to keep in contact with other traders throughout the day. It's a feature that hardly any MetaTrader users actually use, but it's very useful. Chat with other traders and create trading groups. Four. You can add period separators to the charts by going to a chart, right click, go to properties and tick show period separators, click OK, the separators will then appear. The way this works, any time frame less than the daily, so the one hour, four hour, 30 minute, 15 minute, one minute charts will show days, will separate day by day. On the daily, it will separate into weeks, and then on the weekly, it will separate into months. Five. You can download your trade history by going to account history, right clicking and clicking save as report. You'll then receive a nice official report with your trade history and performance on. Six. It's possible to receive alerts to your phone from MetaTrader. So if you place an alert, so if we right click on a chart and go to alert and place an alert, it's then possible to receive that alert to your phone. The way you do that is by downloading the MetaTrader app to your phone. Go to settings once you've logged in and find your Meta Quotes ID. Go to Tools, Options, and Notifications. Tick Enable Push Notifications and put in your Meta Quotes ID. Click OK. You'll then receive notifications to your phone when alerts are triggered. So download the app, log in, go to Settings, find your Meta Quotes ID, Tools, Options, notifications, tick, and enter the ID. Seven. There are a number of quick keys on MetaTrader 4. The most useful are probably F8, which brings up the chart properties. F9, which brings up the order box. F11, which makes a chart full screen, which is very useful sometimes. And then the backspace. The way the backspace works is as you add drawings to a chart, backspace will delete the newest to the oldest drawing in order. Eight. It's possible to get news updates on MetaTrader 4. Just go to the news tab in the terminal. You'll then receive news updates which is extremely useful, which I suggest you start using. Nine. 
it's possible to have multiple accounts on one MetaTrader trading platform. Go to the navigator. You can then see all your live and demo accounts that you've logged into. Alternatively, go to view, click navigator. So log into your multiple accounts and each account you log in will show in this list here. You just go to the account you want to log into, double click on it and follow the instructions. 10. You can customize the sounds that MetaTrader makes. For example, if I place an order, I get a nice Star Wars clip. So let's actually just enter a trade, buy a market, listen to this. Remember, the force will be with you always. Amazing. To do that, just go to Tools, Options, and events, which is here. And then you can change the notification sounds, the sounds on the MetaTrader trading platform. So thank you for watching. Hopefully this video has been helpful. Let me close my position down. Remember, the force will be with you always.